Hey, Jake Evans here, and we want you to come to our class. Yeah, you already know. We already know all the traits it takes to be a good leader, but for some reason we continue to miss the mark. And what we want to do in this class is we bring you through a systematic approach that you can learn these traits and quite frankly just become a better teacher and a better person using the 11 precepts of life. Good morning, we want to welcome you to the YAC presentation. Many of y'all are probably wondering what YAC stands for and it means you already know. Because what we found in life so many times is we can be successful, but a lot of times life happens and what do we do? We stop in our traps. Nothing is more common than unsuccessful people with talent. You know, I think this is for a lot of different reasons. And, and what we do is, life is hard, and so we put the brakes on and we stop. We don't go anymore. We just stop. We give up too easy. It's just like aspiring to catch your dreams. Yeah, it's a great thought in our heart, but then your brain starts telling you you can't do it. A lot of people also, unsuccessful people with talent, if you look at it, we always talk about the extra mile. Go extra mile, go extra mile. And this is mile one. And you know when you're in mile one, it's very crowded. I can put 30, I can put 100 million marks right here on this piece of paper. And mile one is very crowded. Why? Because that's, who, that's the people who do the bare minimum to, to get by in life. I'm sure you have plenty of colleagues at work that do this. But this is crowded at mile one. But I tell you, when success comes, it's when you get to mile two, when you go that extra mile. Why? Because it's lonely. So few people take and use their skills they were given and use their talents and actually progress in life. Or what I like to say is we have excuses. You know, I, I hurt my knee a couple years ago and for the first two years I said I hurt my knee three months ago, that's why I'm not running anymore. And it's a lie. I didn't even realize I was lying to myself. So at some point, we have to let the circumstances, and they're going to do whatever they want. They're going to harp on somebody and find somebody. But once you can defeat all these hard things in life, we must continue down the path to be successful. All these people influence us. And they say things like this. This is what you need to be a good leader. You need to be ethical. You need to be dynamic, confident. We can go down the list of all of them. And most leadership classes will stop short right after they define it. They'll define humble, and that's it. But nobody ever tells you, how do you live with humility? Nobody ever tells you, how do you be more patient in your life? These are all things that in our systematic approach, we can take any of these words, and we can show you how you can have them in your life. How you can obtain them and be a better person, but also put yourself in a better position for those promotions.